Republican Congressman Mike Kelly from Pennsylvania, who got his lawsuit tossed out by the Pennsylvania Supreme Court, now wants the US Supreme Court to issue an emergency order to block Pennsylvania from taking further action regarding the election results in Pennsylvania. The Pennsylvania results are already certified. And so Mr. Kelly is now asking this US Supreme Court to nullify the governor's certification and stop the state from taking any action that will confirm Biden's victory, meaning not to allow the electors to vote during the electoral college meeting. The lower court rejected Mr. Kelly's request last week because what this congressman was asking the court to do is something no court will ever do. Mike Kelly claimed that the Pennsylvania legislature violated the constitution when it allowed no excuse absentee voting in this year's election. The court tossed it out because it said many months have gone since the law was passed and you want us to intervene after the elections are over when you were totally aware of this law all this time. Okay, the court did not say the exact words and I'm paraphrasing it. Also remember who passed the law, the Pennsylvania legislature that was controlled by the Republican Party. And none of these guys had any problem with the law and they would not have had any problem had Trump won. But since Trump lost, they are just trying to make whatever argument they can to turn the election. Ask any legal expert, he will tell you the Supreme Court will keep itself as far as they can when it comes to state legislations. And they go even further away if a state court has already made a decision siding with the legislature. And more than all of that, they try not to touch election dispute cases. I'm not even sure if the Supreme Court will even take this case at all. I think the Supreme Court will try to run the clock out as the electors will vote on December 14th, less than two weeks from now. That's why this might strike you as surprising when the Ivy League educated lawyer come senator and former elections rigger Ted Cruz, lying Ted as our president fondly calls him, released a statement yesterday asking the Supreme Court to hear the case on an expedited basis. Does he not know the Supreme Court will most probably not take the case? And even if it did, it is only going to toss it out. And even if it decides to intervene, Biden has 306 electoral votes and stopping Pennsylvania electors from voting will not do anything at the electoral college meeting because Biden will have a lot more votes than the required with or without Pennsylvania. Ted Cruz of course knows this. Mike Kelly of course knows this. The nine justices are well aware of this. But why did Ted Cruz write an open letter? Well, do you really think the open letter was written for the Supreme Court justices to read as if they don't have something better to do? It was written so that Ted Cruz can tell GOP voters in Texas and around the country when he jumps into the 2024 presidential primary campaign that Ted Cruz always had Trump's back. He was a loyal foot soldier who fought to overturn the election. He even wrote a public letter asking the Supreme Court to hear the case on an expedited basis. But sadly, despite his noble efforts, the Supreme Court never heard the case. Hmm, not bad at all to win the primary, but an excellent ad to lose the general. Way to go Republicans, I can see the 2024 Democratic campaign strategy playbook writing its headlines on its own. Thanks for watching. If you like, please subscribe.